That's the craziest shit I've ever seen. That shit just turned purple. Do you think uh, Facebook is cock blocking? No. Now what? Now I set this fucking thing up again? I don't know what happened. That shit just went, that shit just went purple. That's the craziest shit ever. Boom. All right, we're good now. I don't know what happened. All right, hey, what can you guys see on your side? That shit was crazy. That shit looked like it was, um, like those old TVs that like, you know what I mean? It has a fucking snowstorm. Hey, add me in your bowl. <laughs> I think you're, I think you're, um, what's good, what's good? Anyways, man, shout out to everybody tuning in already. Ed Sellers, Brenda, what's happening? We got Martha Sellers, we got Carol, we got Taker, we got Beto, we got Abby, we got Lyrics. What's up, homie? Alma, so did I win? Natasha, Paula, what's up, prima? But Vanessa is in here. I see your pretty eyes. Are you trying to get, are you trying to get more names in here? Anyways, for you guys, like, for you guys that were just tuned in, um, I just went live and it was crazy. My eyes are purple? No, that shit was crazy. I don't know what you guys saw on that other side. Um, Jessica, what's happening? But that shit was uh, all freaking purple. The screen was like, it was freaking purple and shit. That shit is crazy. I got purple eyes? I don't know. I can't see it on this side. Anyways, man, it's your boy Monsky Nitro Average Radio. It's going down. Shout out to the Solid Kings. Man, another shirt. Exclusive. You guys can't buy this shit, but guess what? You can win it right here on Nitro Average Radio. And we are going to announce the winner. Wait. Did I say today? We're going to announce the winner. Yes, it was Purple Scrambles. Isn't that weird? That, that's exactly what I saw on this side, too. That was the weirdest fucking thing ever. Weirdest thing ever. But anyways, um, I'm going to give you guys one more ch one more day to enter to win. $50 and 3 uh, Solid King shirts. The reason why, tomorrow I'm going to be in Hollywood. I'm going to hang out with the homie Big Citric. And you know what? He's he's giving away the um, the shirts. And he's part of the, the crew that's giving away the $50. So I think he should be there. And, and, and we should pick out the names. And um, or we'll have the whole crew there. We'll have like one person each pick out a name of who's going to win the t-shirts. And who's going to win the $50. So what do you guys think about that? So I'm going to say... Since I am the one that uh, it's, I'm supposed to call it on Wednesday, it is Wednesday. Since I, it's supposed to be called on Wednesday, uh, the uh, the winner. Did you add me? I shared yesterday. Yes, everybody that shared um, and keep it shared. I see some of you fucking shiesty little mother freakers. Um, I, I go back later and you guys unshare it and it gets off your. It's like like two people that I've caught. Um, so what I'm doing? I used to like right after the broadcast. Right after the broadcast, like say for example on Monday, uh, hey Tammy, what's happening? L let's just say on Monday, um, all you guys shared the video, right? And then I would go in there, and as I'm checking off the names of who shared the video, I would like the video, kind of give you guys a heads up. Hey, Monsky saw that you shared the video, you know what I mean? And then I, I caught a few times, a few people that I went back to the profile, and that video wasn't shared anymore, you know, or it loses it loses shares on the um, on the video itself, you know, like if I had like 40 shares. I go back the next day, it has 38. Anyways, so now what I'm doing is you guys can share Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, whatever. But I'm not counting the shares until like the day of. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go through it tomorrow morning because I, I will do that. We'll do the um we'll do the uh, drawing tomorrow with Omi Big Citric. Um Diz, what's happening, brother? Missy Mitchell's in the building. Yeah, so tomorrow we're gonna do the the the, the drawing and I'll I'll check it tomorrow morning. So if you guys shared this video and you guys thought that I gave, I put your name in the in the bowl yesterday or the day before, and you're like, oh, let me just unshare the video the next day. Well, you're fucked because I haven't put any names down or nothing. I see you guys. I see you guys. It's all right. We all we learn. We learn as we go. It's human nature to try to be, you know, shiesty sometimes. When you, but you got you got to. Hey, you got me. I sure. You all the time, and I don't delete you. I know you don't. I know Martha. I know the sellers are, are solid people. Um, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna put anybody on blast or anything like that. But anyways, so what I was saying. Um, what I was saying is, is uh, if you guys haven't shared, go ahead and share this video to be entered um, to win. But 
since today is supposed to be the drawing day uh, for you guys to win, I'm going to go ahead and whoever, if, if you guys have shared Monday and Tuesday, because I'm going to look at the fucking video, I'm going to share it on Monday, I'm going to go look at Monday and Tuesday and you will be entered once into Night Chavage Radio. And you ha if you haven't shared Mondays and Tuesdays, go ahead and go back and share those now to be entered once. Or share this one to be entered once. But if you already shared those videos, like the good followers and friends that you guys are, um, go ahead and share this video right here, and I will put your name a second time into the into the drawing. You know what I mean? Because today is supposed to be the drawing. Um, I, I thought it was I thought it would be cool to have the big homie Citric call your guys' names, and we've been talking about getting your guys' names in here multiple times. So go ahead and share this video right here, and you'll be entered a second time. This video right here. Like again, if you guys, I shared your music video too. What music video? Do I have a music video? <laughs> I'm not even an artist and I got music videos. Now I know you're lying, Rebecca. Oh shit, here comes Contreras. All right, so that, that's what's going on. A drawing. Gina Garnica, what's happening? So that's going on. We're giving away. Okay, so uh, Tina Jones. If uh, you haven't been here for the last, I don't know, month, <laughs> we're giving away $50 tomorrow. We're giving away $50 tomorrow. And we're giving away three Solid Kings t-shirt exclusively right here only on Not Your Average Radio. Because the homie Big Citric is hooking it up. And you can only win them here. You can only get them here because they are unavailable. You can't buy them anywhere. Exclusive shit right here on Not Your Average Radio. Again, shout out to homie Big Citric. All the homies of Solid Kings. Uh, well, I wasn't sure which drawing. Well, I, I was just letting you know. I was just letting you know. The thing about me... This is entertainment right here. You know what I'm saying? So um, I exaggerate a little bit. You know what I mean? So don't take it too personal. It's all love. And uh, I appreciate every single one of you guys. So that's what's going on. And for you newbies that are just coming on, uh, tomorrow when we do pick the drawing, um, you have to be present. You have to be present to in order to win. Uh, oh, you know what? Tomorrow is 8 o'clock. So tomorrow I'm going to be in Hollywood. We have an, another freaking comedy show, 8 o'clock. So that means that it's probably going to be like at 7 o'clock tomorrow. So stay tuned for that. So around 7 o'clock tomorrow, we're going to be picking out four winners. Four winners. You guys are just tuning in. Share this video right here. Again, you have to share the last two videos, either Monday or Wednesday, uh, Monday or Tuesday. You, must have, you should have, must have shared one of those videos. And if you share this video right now, you'll be entered twice. So I appreciate you guys. One, what does one mean? <laughs> so that's what's going on with that, man. So what else? Oh, yeah, this Friday. Okay, tomorrow we're going to be in Hollywood. That show's already uh, sold out, so I can't give away tickets for that. But this Friday, this Friday we're going to be at Levity Live. Levity Live, Oxnard, California. So if you guys are interested in, um, in going to the show, hit me up. We got some VIP tickets, some free tickets for you guys to enjoy the show. Um, you know what I mean? And who knows? We might be giving away some shit that day too. Um, I, might, I might pull up. Hey, shout out to Martha Sellers for giving me this idea. I might just go live that, uh, that day because the show's not till like 9.45. So I'll probably be there about 8. So I'll be having an hour and 45 minutes to do shit. So I might just pull up and say, whoever shows up to Levity Live right now and come says what's up to Monsky in person, you guys will win. I don't know what the fuck you guys might win, but you guys will win something. So, and that's going to be courtesy, uh, not courtesy, but it was her idea. So sponsored by Martha Sellers. You know what I mean? You should have happy hour. There you go. Happy hour with Monsky. For the first person that shows up, or whoever shows up, nah, not whoever, fuck that. There'll be like five of you guys. The first person to show up, okay, to, uh, should I just do it? Fuck it. I, I don't know if I want to just do it. The next giveaway is, really, Ed? Ed's going to just count to what? Are you paying? Okay, see, Martha, that's exactly what I was saying. Um, the first person to show up, the first person to show up, I will buy you guys a drink. One person, I will buy you a drink. Now, if multiple people want to come and hang out with me and you pay for your own fucking drinks, then we can do that. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to buy, I'll fuck around and have like 100 people show up and like, hey, Monsky said he's going to buy us drinks. I don't think so. 
A drink, Martha. A drink. Well, it depends what you drink. You know what I mean? If you drink water, I got you all night. All night long. I got you all night. But if you drink anything that costs any type of money, then you probably just get one. Miguel Angel, what's happening? Ed's going to order the most expensive. I don't give a shit. Whatever it is, you want to order a, a freaking champagne, put it on Monsky's tab. One person. So that's, what, that's what's up, man. So one person, first person that comes up to me on uh, Friday. Friday at Levity Live. We're in Oxford, California. Um, I will buy you a drink. And anybody else that wants to come and just chill, uh, we'll just put this shit on live if you guys want. And we'll hang out live right here and you guys can talk shit to the people that are listening. Pre-game before the show. That's what I'm saying. It's before the show. Tailgate, bring your old beer. Oh, tailgate though. No, no, no. It's, it's going to be on Friday before the show. The The comedy show starts at 9.45. So I'll probably, shit, I'll probably show up. Because I, for you guys that don't know how this, uh, you guys have never seen Levity Live and Copper Blues, they're like this. <laughs> Levity Live is a comedy show, Copper Blues is a bar. And they're like right next to each other. Like you can walk from the inside of Levity and you can walk into Copper Blues. Like you, you don't have to go outside. It just goes straight across. Um, so yeah, that's what's up with Monsky. Friday, Ed's got a date with Monsky. Bring it on. I, I get, I, I'll buy Ed a drink. I need to meet that motherfucker anyway. He's crazy as shit. So yeah, that's what that's what's going to happen. We're gonna do that. Sendejas, what's up, brother? So this Friday, we are gonna do that. First person to show up when I go live about maybe seven, seven thirty. Shit, the show is at nine forty-five. Like I'll be chilling right there. Phil Medina's gonna be there. Like I don't know who else is gonna be there. You can chill, have, chill with me, have a brew, um, whatever the case might be. Talk, talk some shit. Oh, speaking about talking some shit, something that I was thinking of doing, and again. I take, you know, whatever ideas you guys have, I take them into consideration. And, um, you know, because this is what you guys, I wonder if the lady that got mad yesterday will be on today. What lady got mad? Hey, watch it. He gets frisky when he drinks. I, me too. <laughs> hey, I'm not scared. Ask Contreras. It wouldn't be the first time. Right, Contreras? What kind of beer do I drink? Uh, I prefer... Modelos, Modelos is my shit. Uh, I don't mind drinking Coronas. I don't mind drinking um, um, Heineken's are dope. Uh, I don't drink. I don't like Dos Equis. Um, I don't like Budweiser. And other than that, I drink about anything. I don't like Guinness or something like that. I don't really like dark beers. Not that I'm racist. I like um, I like light skinned beer. I like blondes. <laughs> but anyways, um, yeah. So I, I, I like to take a, a lot of you know people's people's um ideas and stuff into consideration and i have a lot of people hitting me up about ideas about shows blue moons i fuck with blue moons ed you and i if you show up friday um to copper blues first first person i will buy you a blue moon and we'll share a blue moon together live right here on that average radio bucanas and cranberry I, I i really don't fuck with um i really don't fuck with uh liquor too much anymore i just just chill have some beers and stuff like that because um I, uh, back in the Marine Corps, woo, we used to drink Crown Royal and Coke, and that shit right there. The last time I drank that shit, I think I got a DUI, so I'm like, okay, I can't drink this. We used to get into a lot of fights. Um, we got locked up in we got locked up in Mexico a few times. Got into some fights. Um, got in trouble, you know, like in the Marines and stuff like that. So yeah, Crown. Crown Royal and Coke is not really my my uh, my my drink, you know what I mean? Vinny, what's up, brother? Yup, you're still a little bitch. <laughs> anyway, so hey, fights were good. Fireball? Oh no, I don't fuck with Fireball. Yes, I do not fuck with I do not fuck with Fireball. That's disgusting. Cinnamon, like that shit, like just a big. You might as well just get cinnamon throw it in your mouth. Ah. Ugh. Anyways, it's like having forty five. Candy canes in your mouth at one time. Not that I would know. <laughs> Not that I've tried it. Wait, all night. What? Coin night. Oh, shit. How long have you been doing Not Your Average Radio? All right, lyrics. Um, I've been doing Not Your Average Radio. What month are we? August. So, three years and eight months. Uh, I started January, I think it's 6th, January 6th of 2014. Um... 
So this past January, we just uh, celebrated three months, three years, three months, three years. Um, I even had a cake done for it. If you guys go back, I even had the logo. Shout out to Sonia. Uh, she, she fucking hooked it up. Uh, we had a Tres, Le Tres Leches cake. Um, it had the logo on it. It was dope. It had like the freaking logo. Uh, I think I said like five times right now because that was super exciting. And I even bought the little, I bought the number three candle and we, uh, we burned it right. We did it right here. Not your average radio saying happy birthday and did the whole thing. Do I get to pick the Not Your Average Radio tap? Tequila? Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. How long? Okay, so that's that. That's mine. Uh, you'll have to drink the strongest one they have. Black Velvet straight gets me in such trouble. Ha! <laughs> let's, go, let's go drink some Black Velvet. Or tequila. Not Your Average Radio been around for two weeks. Do I get to pick Not Your Average Radio tat? Wow, that's awesome, bro. Congrats. Thank you. Yes. Let's go back to the tat idea. Okay, before we go back to the tat idea, let's talk about um, let's talk about some other ideas real quick. Because I already know what Contreras is gonna say about this, but this is real shit. Because I take you guys, your guys, you guys's, your guys's. Um, tell Ed wants to get that tat. Tell him no. Ed, let's go get it together. I need someone to go with me to go get that tattoo. Oh, you know what? Hold on, real quick. I know you guys can still see me. Um. I gotta, I gotta invite some people real quick. I forgot about that. Hold on, hold on, hold up. Wait a minute. Who, who's, who's that? Oh, here we go. I know you guys can see me. I wanted to invite some people. I forgot about that. Um, I guess I don't know how to spell their name. Anyways, good enough. Hello, go away. Anyways, yes, we need it. We all should go get a. Hey, Ed, myself, and Contreras. We should all go, go get tattoos. Um, Contreras, you pay for them. Ed, you pick the location. And I just show up. How's that? It's like a freaking family affair. Anyway, so I ha I've had some ideas from people. Um, a lot of people hit me up. You know, like, Monsky, why are you so? Why are you always full of energy? Why are you always so motivated? Like, I'm telling you. People have been telling me this stuff. And um, every time they talk to me, I'm like, I'm doing outstanding. I'm amazing. All that good stuff. And um, And they tell me, you know, like... Like, fuck, man, like, I wish I had your energy. I wish I was positive like you. I wish I had your life. And I'm like, what the fuck? You want my life? You know, because I know what my life consists of or what it has consists of. And as you can tell, Contreras has been in my life for almost 17 years. So th there's a good example of what my life has been. <laughs> you know what I mean? So my life is not, obviously, I've been doing Nacho Avedrado for only like three, three and a half years. Um, and so obviously it's not been the whole time. Um, so I tell people, you know what I mean? I just look at the positives because you can't be sad and happy at the same time. So if you're focused on the sad shit, you're always going to be sad. And it's going it's, to it's grow. And it's like an avalanche, you know what I mean? Not a um, snowball. Brrr, snowball effect. But if you think on the positive, you can only be positive and you do that. So I tell people this kind of stuff. And they're like, Monsky, you should do like a, um, like a Dr. Phil on your show and have people just like comment in or send in like a problem that you guys want to talk about, and like, like a life coach kind of thing. And I was like, okay, we can do that. So that's why I'm bringing it up to you guys. What do you think about that? Is that a compliment or a curse? <laughs> so what do you guys think about that? Like, like doing like, like a segment, maybe one of these days, just like ask Monsky or something. You know, it's Monsky, so I have a little bit of serious to me, and I have a little bit of uh, funny to me. So, you know, I might spin it a little bit. And um, and you guys, and again, if you guys want to comment, like, a situation that you guys had, and let the world see it, and I talk about it, that's fine. Or um, if you guys want to DM me, and it would be 100% confidential, um, or, or create, the laugh says it all. <laughs> Or, or create a, a, fake, a fake page or whatever and send me the information. But, um, you know, like if you have some serious, serious shit that you want to talk about, well, we can talk about it right here on Your Average Radio. But again, it's mostly for entertainment purposes. It's mostly for entertainment purposes, but I will give you my opinion on um, a, a what it is. You know what I mean? Because I do have a lot of people, like I said, asking me like, Monsky, um, you know, like how you stay motivated, how you keep fucking going, how do you stay focused? Um, you know, how do you keep doing what you do? You know, I've, I've only been doing Nacho Average Radio for three years, you know what I mean? And, um, it, and they say it's supposed to take 10 years to master a craft, you know what I mean? I think I've been doing pretty good for, for, for the, the case that, that is. 
And I always tell people, my secret to success is that I fucked up a lot in my 20s. <laughs> you know what I mean? I fucked up royally in my 20s. And so it's like, I'm even helping out people that are like in their 40s. You know, they're like, Monsky, I'm so stressed out and blah, 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 blah. And I was just like, no, this is how you got to do it. This is what you got to think of. Or I've been through that already. Um, whatever the case is, you know what I mean? So um, just to give you an example, I was, I got married at 19. I was in the, wait, wait, first I got we were in the Marine Corps at 19, got married at 19, went to Iraq at, how old were we? 22? I went to Iraq when I was 22, and um, my son was born when I was 23. So by the time I was 23, I had been, by the time I was like 25, I had been married, uh, gone to war, had a kid, and divorced. <laughs> so, um so by the time I was 25, I had gone through all that. You know what I mean? So I, I have a lot of experience. I have a lot of fuck ups, and um, and that's how, that's how I, how I've become who I've become, who I've became. But I'm definitely not good at my English, obviously. But yeah, we can do that. Whatever you guys want to do, the, it's the Monsky Show. Ingrid, what's happening? Fucking keep it real. Put the shit out there. Going through. I just want to be in the cheese man. I know you guys will love that shit because you guys love the cheese man, especially the sellers. Doctor Monsky, Julie, what's up, Julie? Julie's in the building. You forgot to mention when you became bald. Uh, I started losing my hair when I was 23. <laughs> we were, was it when I was in Iraq? We were, no, we were on a, on a, on a, I think it was WTI. Yay, finally watching live. Julie's in the building. So Julie, you just missed it. I just, I was just giving, uh, seeing what their feedback was about doing my, my Dr. Monsky show. You know what I mean? Going live and, and, and talking about people's um, situations. I don't want to call it issues or anything like that. Again, I don't believe in positive or negative. You know what I mean? Everything is everything. Is everything. It is what it is. It's someone's perception, whether it's positive or negative. Like right now, if I go over there and I fucking kick Contreras in the face, you know what I mean? Like to me, that's a positive. I'm like, ha, you got kicked in the face. But for him, it's probably a negative. The situation didn't change. You know what I mean? It's the same shit. But it's just the way you perceive it. If you get kicked in the fucking face, it's usually a negative thing. Um, and if, you, if, you, if you're the one doing it, it's probably a positive thing. And yes, you're right. I'm pretty sure. And he's right. I'm pretty sure he'd laugh. And he'd scare the fuck out of me and I'd probably run away. Because <laughs> if you kick somebody in the face and they start laughing, uh, you better run. That's just, that's just, you know, that's just common sense. Uh, we got Sarah, Elizabeth. What's happening? Jenna. Jenny. Jenny Ham's in the building. Uh, Jenny, you said you were from where? Um, Ohio. Was it you that said you were Ohio? I think she said she was from Ohio. So, yeah, we got Ohio in the building. Where else? Hey, where else we got? Roll call. Roll call. Um, tell me what state you guys are from. If you guys are from California, tell me what, um, you know, what area you guys are from. But if you guys are from out of state, it doesn't really matter if you tell me what city you are because I probably don't even fucking know. But let's do that. Roll call right now. Let me know where you guys are from. Kansas, I was close. I'm from California, so Kansas, Ohio, it's the same shit over here. <laughs> Lake Elsinore, but I come on, fool, you're from Wilma's, homie. Lake Elsinore, 805, Santa Paula, what's happening? Santa Paula, Califas, Topeka, Kansas. Like I said, doesn't matter what city you're from. I don't know where that shit is. KY. You're from KY Jelly. Oh, Missy. Missy's from Ohio. So we got Kansas. We got Ohio. Uh, that's dope. Um, Fillmore. We got Fillmore. We got Santa Paula. We got Contreras out there in fucking Lake Elsinore. Close. Yes. Wilmington. Uh, easy there, zip code. 805 in the building. That's what I'm talking about. Yes. Almost ended up in Tracy, California. All right, that's what's up, man. So we got we got people from uh, from around the country. I like that. I appreciate you guys tuning in right here. Um, currently, I am in Carpinteria, California. It's like 20 minutes away from Santa Barbara. A beautiful, beautiful area. And um, I'm from Moore Park. Big bad Moore Park, Kentucky. Holy fuck. Why are you listening to me? <laughs> I'm sorry, but um, no, 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 that's Oklahoma. Is that Kentucky too? I don't know. Just figure that you would want to watch someone that... Listen to the country. I don't know. I love you, Mosky. <laughs> I love you guys too, man. I really do. I do appreciate. I love the uh, the support and the um, just support, man. Support that you guys give us. More part and what? MFB on me. What's up? Let's do that shit. Are you guys gonna come out? I'm saying it right now. That lyrics is from Mexico, even though I saw him out there in Madeira. 
The wifey made me some tacos, the cha 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 roll. The fuck does that say? With salsa, the molcha que. What the f dude? Speak English, homie. Speak English, bro. This is America. This is America. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I know it's a chicharron. I know it says molcajete. I am kidding. <laughs> He's gonna talk mad shit right now. Uh, let's see here. He agrees. <laughs> Scott agrees that he should be listening to someone that listens to country. Hey there, buddy. We listen to country right here, not your average radio. Hey, Pudge Fifty Five is in the building, man. So hey, let me know. So. America, <laughs> America, home of the brave. So check this out. So now I want your opinion of when we should do this. When do you guys want to do, um, what should we call it? <laughs> oh shit, fucking whitewash Norteño piece of dog shit. <laughs> now that's, some, okay, so let me, oh shit, I'm about to knock this table over. I'm getting so excited. Uh, let, me, let me translate for Contreras. That means, buddy, we, we've been friends for a long time. I appreciate, you know, all the love you've ever shown me, and uh, we're going to be friends forever. That's what that means. Very good accent. <laughs> I've been watching Larry the Cable Guy. Even though he's not, he's not redneck either, it's just a character he created, just like me. When you see me in the street, my name is, my real name is Ramon. When you see Ramon in the street, he's like, I'm in, like, I'm, I'm in a suit, got a briefcase, and I'm just like, Hello. I'm religious, all that good stuff. And when you see Monsky, that fool's crazy. You know what I mean? So it's just a character. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> I'm just kidding. This is me. It no matter what time you see me. Monsky, you are a load of mom. What the fuck? Monsky, you are a load. You are a load. Your mama should have swallowed. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> a little. A little. Oh, Mark Cordetti, we got a freaking, hey, shout out to Mark Cordetti, one of the best, uh, one of the best bass players in the world, in America, and the world. So, right, so we're talking about the Dr. Monsky show. Mons, Monskin though, Monskin, what the hell? <laughs> so, yeah, so we're talking about the Monsky show. Let me know when you guys think it's a good time. Should we just do it randomly? Or should we do it, like... Um, set up an email and have people message you their drama. Give your opinion. Let us judge. <laughs> oh shit! Oh, that's that's inside joke. All right. Um, create an email. Let's do that shit right now. I can do that shit right now. Let's create an email. What should it be? It's gonna be Doctor Monsky at Gmail. Oh, but I can't do that right now. Because I forgot, I'm I'm playing the uh, I'm playing the screen. Okay, so I like Doctor Monsky show. Hey, I'm gonna be not your average Doctor Monsky. So that's why you guys know that I'm not a real doctor. <laughs> Disclaimer: I am not a real doctor. Um, I am maybe a doctor by I have plenty of experience of fuck ups in my life that I could have. You know, I could be a doctor through experience, probably, probably, but. You know, I do give some good advice. I will, I will give you some good advice. Did you hear the one about the one-legged Japanese woman? All right, there we go. So do you guys, did you guys hear about the one-legged Japanese woman? Irene? No, that's the, that, that's the, that's the, the woman with the wooden leg. The woman with the wooden leg, her name is Eileen. She leans to the side, get it? Lean? No. Nope. N-Y-A-R uh, doctor. Oh, Lord, people going for your advice. Her name is Eileen. Oh, see, that's what it was. Yeah, yeah. Her name is Eileen. I got it. I got it. People are going for your advice, right? That's why it's not your average radio. I love it. Who, who, hey, Steph, I really do. I give some good advice. Maybe you should come to me one of these days. Let me know your problems, and I'll help you. But, hey, I should start charging for this shit. I'm just giving away too much free stuff. Well, you know, when is Monsky going to get some shit back? I'm going to charge you guys. Let's see, what should I charge you guys? I would say a beer, but my liver is not 100% uh, happy with my... I, for, the, for the last 16 years, I've drank like every day of my life. <laughs> and I went to the VA and they were just like, uh, your liver is not really doing too well. Like, do you drink? And I'm like, yeah. They're like, 
how often? I'm like, every day. They're like, every day? I'm like, every day. And they're like, okay, Monday through Friday or every every day on the weekend? I'm like, no, every day, Monday through Monday. Like, what the fuck does that every day mean? You know? And they're like, how many beers do you have? I'm like, usually about four. I started off with the 12-pack. <laughs> Back in the Marine Corps, uh, when I was, what, 20, 23, 23 years old, I used to drink a 12-pack a day. Um, that didn't go too well. <laughs> that got really expensive really fast. Um, so... You know, being a smart person that I am, I was like, yo, if I drink half of this 12-pack, it's going to last me two days. You know, because if you have one and you cut it in half, it equals two. And I was like, wow. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know why I feel like venting to you guys today. I need you guys. You guys are my doctor. You guys are my doctor, not your average radio listeners. Not your average listeners. You guys are my doctors. So, I got something to say. I've had this rash. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Speaking about herpes, hey, so does does Usher have herpes or no? I'm so confused with all this shit going on. I don't even want to talk about it. I'm just wondering what's going on. Her name is Eileen. Her name is Irene Monsky, though. LOL. Ha, ha, ha. I'll give advice, too. 1050. Can I get a refund? Can, can you only head some of my bit? What the fuck? Saw the King's repost. Oh, shout out to Saw the King's reposting my shit. Head some of my bitch. We still need... Want the GoPro and the tattoo. Okay, we'll talk about the. Okay, so as of right now, we'll talk about doing the uh, Dr. Monsky show next week. Um, I got, I st- I, like they said, I got to set up an email. I'm going to try to do it under. I need to do it under do- Dr. Monsky. Fuck it. Dr. Phil isn't a real doctor either. So, <laughs> and, and the people that the, the LLC or the corporate company that owns um, Subway, it's it's like Doctors United or some shit. It's just the name of the company. They're not really doctors, by the way. They're investors. Um, so I, I might as well be Dr. fucking Monsky. So I'm going to make it drmonsky at gmail.com. I'm pretty sure that's not taken. As long as you don't drink alone, you're okay. I used to drink alone. I used to drink alone in the corner of my room. Uh, if, you, if you go down, uh, what's today? Tomorrow. Tomorrow I have a bunch of videos that um, if you go down in my Instagram, go all the way to the bottom, like that first year and a half, I was just drinking on Not Your Average Radio. I even had a cup. You know what I mean? It was a mug. And I used to, it, 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 that even has a Twitter page. It was called Not Your Average Cup. Um, there's a Twitter page. It has like 2,000 followers. Um, what else have I done in my in my uh, last three and a half years? I cre- yeah, I created a page for it. I used to have a name. I used to do skits with it. I there was a point that I wanted like to take it to the beach and go on dates on with it, but I never did that. Um, yeah, so I, I've done a lot. So yeah, so if you go to the bottom of my Instagram and you get you know that that first year or something, you'll see a lot of drinking happening on Not Your Average Radio. Yes, get up and dance. Monsky's goal when he got out of the Marine Corps was drunk and a wife beater. I got, I got the drunk part right. Do a happy dance. What's up? What the fuck? I'm just reading the comments. You guys want me to dance? Sabrina Sanchez was happening. Tech problems over here. Dance for us, Monsky. Yes, sir. Dance. Jesus fucking Christ. Uh, that's pretty sad. Don't drink alone, you alcoholic. You can borrow Ed. Dance. I have a cup of change to throw. Oh, speaking about change... Uh, Platinums Zuniga What's up Zuniga When I'm alone in my room Sometimes I stare at the wall Oh shit Easy there L.O. Cool J When I'm alone in my room Sometimes I stare at the wall Da 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 Something like that Um, Drinking alone is good for you Lila Buddy Nelson What's happening Oh yeah Do the Monsky dance What up What's up Zuniga Okay so the only problem I love 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 Facebook Right now The way I figured it out which was like, I was trying to make it super complicated. I was gonna get like 45 cameras, put them around me, all that good stuff. And I was like, I want the Facebook feed to go to all my places, AKA to notyouraveragedradio.com, to YouTube, to Periscope, to Livestream, to, I think that's it. Um, so yeah, so I wanted you guys to see all that shit, but I couldn't figure it out. So I just figured it out yesterday or, the, or this week. All I got to do is bring up Facebook on the internet here and I can show you guys what I'm looking at. So all I just do is crop out the video and now everybody can see this video. So those guys over there, well, I used to have a camera over there. Oh, it's over here now, chilling, but it doesn't work right now. Well, it's not on. Um, you, can, you guys all can see me. You can all interact with me with Dr. Monsky. I like that. Speaking about Dr. Monsky. Oh, oh, so man. I get sidetracked really fast. So I don't want to dance because 
I can't put music on. That is one thing that is bad about this fucking thing called Facebook. That if I put music, if I put music on, um, it's gonna tag me, and if you don't own it, it's gonna block me for a week, and that's no fun. Cause we got a Dr. Monsky show to do. Like I seriously have to fucking broadcast in a silent room. <laughs> Like, even if I start, like, rapping and it sounds like a freaking song, or if I start singing and it sounds like a song, it's going to block me. Facebook and I have a love-hate relationship. They really do. I see you guys going crazy over here in comments. Jesus. Um, Monsky dance. What the heck is the Monsky dance? Do the hustle. What up? Um, bring it, bring it, though. Mark Cordetti, you really want to see me dance. Does it involve a pull? He has to show the Monsky dance. He does it at work. When you drink alone, you don't have to share. Just saying. There you go. What's up, Zuniga? You know what's up. Oh, now he has to do it. See, but... Oh, man. See, see, agrees. Come on. I make, I'll make, i make you a beat. Pretend you can hear it. Just do the moves. Everybody make them dance. Make up a beat. You do the Monsky dance without music. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Uh, I have dollars. Dollars? You think I'm a freaking cheap whore? <laughs> You gotta bring on some 20s, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Something about me is give the public what they want. But I just can't do it. It just happens. Um, ask Julie. I don't just do it. Like, like, like she doesn't say, do the Monsky dance. And I start doing the Monsky dance. I, it takes me a while. Like, like, that takes me a while. I have to feel it. Oh, man. We gotta do the fucking Monsky dance right now. Yeah, man. Gotta give you guys what you want. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna pretend that I'm just like, Feeling it, and I'm feeling good, and I feel like doing the monkey dance. And Ed, it does not involve a pole. Not, not right now. Boo. Boo what? Yes, you can. Okay. Do it. How's the monkey dance? It's like, is it like this? No, that's a, that's a lean like, see, I'm trying to do the lean like a cholo dance. Lean like a cholo. Now, what is it? Hold on. All right, here we go. Okay, but I don't want to stand up because I look a little rounder when I'm standing up than when I'm sitting down. I don't want you guys, hey, how is it? I want to do like the cholo dance for some reason. How, did, how does it go? Hey, give me some music, somebody. Contreras, give me, no, not Contreras. He's going to give me some corridos or some shit. How do I do it? I, I, I think it's like, it's kind of like the cholo dance. Man, I'm all embarrassed now. I'm all red, huh? No, I'm not. Anyways, so it's kind of like the cholo dance, like lean like a cholo. But you got it. All right, so it is like that. Like, uh, uh. No, I can't do it. I'm not feeling it. Jiggle it. I, I'm not feeling it. I'm really not feeling it. Uh, let me see. Maybe I can do it over here. Let's come over here. Casting couch. A lot of videos have been filmed there. <laughs> go, just go to Pornhub. Let me see. What, what do we got? What do we got, people? I can't do it. Stop staring at me. Okay, I have an idea. I have an idea. Close your eyes, and it's like a dance from the Goonies. That's funny. People, people always said I look like the guy from the Goonies. Hey, you guys. Okay, so. Let me see. All right, so I'm pretending you guys aren't there. And all right, someone cue me in. Action. Well, let me fix myself. <laughs> oh, how about I do the moonwalk? OK, that really, that really wasn't the moonwalk. I don't know, someone texted me. How's the monkey dance? I'm so nervous now. Like, uh. Uh, oh, here it is. I got it. I got it. Uh, uh, the Molsky dance. Uh, now I can't stop. Now I can't stop. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, that's enough. That's enough of that. <laughs> Julie, was, it, was that it? Yup, you're white. <laughs> that was it, right? That was the Molsky dance. Yes, there it is. See, I knew I had it in me. Whew. I knew I had it in me. All right, so who's next? Who's coming on right here and they're gonna show us their dance moves? Jim, what's happening, Jim? Viviana Duncan's in the building. You just missed the Molsky dance. That's how my uncle dances when he's like, what, a 30 pack in? <laughs> Woo. What did I miss? Tell her what she missed. Okay, you can stop now. Ed, don't hate. Don't hate, Ed, that you don't got, you don't got moves like me, bro. You don't got moves like me. What is verga? Don't hate. Haters are going to hate. Shake it like it's hot. I'll give you, I'll give you 10 fitty. The fuck does that mean? Quit being a bitch, little moves. You have to be holding two beers. That's why you can't do it. See, that's why, is that weird how I dance like that? Drop it. I'm going back. It's like a dance with the Goonies. 
Dun, 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 jiggle it. I think I, I think I read these already. All right. So let's get back to business. Um, for you guys that are just tuning in, we are giving away $50 tomorrow right here on Not Your Average Radio. So make sure you share this video. If you have shared the video from Monday and the video from Tuesday and you share this video right here, I'm going to put your name in there twice. Twice. Look at They're already ready to go. They're all ready to go. If, if I would pick a winner, it would be this person right here. But who knows? You guys tune in tomorrow. I'm going to be chilling tomorrow in Hollywood with the homie Big Citric. We're giving away $50. It's speaking about Big Citric, he, he uh, is blessing us with three. With three? With three Solid King shirts. Shout out to the homie Big Citric. Um, these are exclusive. You can't get them anywhere except right here on our Average Radio. So you better ask somebody. All right, so what else, what else is going on? Where did the dollar bills twerk off between you and me? Let's do it. Ed, can I call you in and we'll have like a dance off? Like you'll be on, I'll be on this side, you'll be on this side. And then like I'll dance and then you dance and then we'll have them vote. Good dance. See, I, I like Tina. Tina knows what's up. I think people should post their Monsky dance. Twerk off live. Twerk off. Oh, Ed. <laughs> Damn, it's already, it's already, it's already uh, 847. I'm having, I'm having too much fun. I have too much fun. I gotta go at nine o'clock today because I got something to do. But it has been fun, and we're gonna do this shit again tomorrow. But I'm not gonna dance because I'm gonna be hanging out with the homies. Yes, I want to see a dance off. Ed, are you down? What's up? What's up, Ed? Are we gonna do a dance off live right here on Not Your Average Radio? <laughs> Whoever does a dance off with me right here, I'll put your name on there again. Another one. You have your name in there three times. This is hilarious. This is not your average radio. Next time. See you. Hey, that's what you said last time. So good to see you to do the dance off. Yes, yeah, see, everybody wants to dance off, Ed. Are you down? I keep forgetting about the time difference. I'm down to twerk. You want me to call you in? Okay, let me call. Let me. Hey, Mark Cordetti says he'll dance. <laughs> hey, I should make Mark Cordetti dance because you're the one that brought all this shit up. It was all your fault. You like to see? Okay, I'm gonna call Ed. Let's see if he's down. Wait, let me put my Nagachonis on. Oh shit! What the hell is ten fifty? <laughs> Dance off tomorrow? Not tomorrow. Why? Why tomorrow? Tomorrow I'm gonna be hanging out with the homies, and I, I, I don't want them to think that I'm some kind of weirdo. You know what I mean? With the Solid Kings, because we're Solid Kings, that's where I'll be hanging out tomorrow. I act like a motherfucking king. I'm like, yo, check this out. Let's go beat somebody up. Let's go take over a country. I have to bounce. Whoa, who's bouncing? I have to bounce, but I can't. Ed can't dance though. Dance off, dance off. Let's go. Let him, let him prepare. The fuck is he stretching out? <laughs> I didn't prepare. I just did it. Oh shit! More is in the building. What's up, more? I need a banana hammock. It means ten fifty, ten fifty, dummy. Six hundred and fifty. No shit. Booty shorts. Booty booty rocking everywhere. Booty 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 rocking everywhere. That's what's up. Not your average dance contest going live right here. Not your average radio, man. I don't know how I get myself into this shit. Call Mark. I bet you want to see that shit, Julie. Well, okay. So, um, so Ed's preparing speedos only. Wear speedos and cowboy boots. So who's down? Who's down? Whoever, whoever comments that they're down, I'm gonna call you guys right now. Shout out to Mr. Pete. Got to get back the Jetson Sound guy on the moped back on. Got to get... <laughs> That's the homie Blur right there. Yes, call Mark. Okay, wifey says don't call Ed. She, okay, we're going to call Mark. Let's see if that's We're going to do the dance video. It's going down. We got like 10 minutes. No music. Inviting, inviting, invite. Mark's like, what the fuck is this calling me? He said, 1050, 1050, Mark, Mark Cordetti, and, nope, declined, oh, all that shit talking, he logged off, he was like, fuck this, <laughs> okay, let me call Ed, let's see if Ed will do it, come on, Ed, 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 you, you, you haven't let me down, you haven't let me down, don't do it now. <laughs> don't let me down now. This fool was on live with no shirt on and shit. He don't give a shit. 
Let me see. Let me see. Man, you guys want, you guys are selfish. All you guys want is for Monsky to move it, shake it, give shit away. Oh, look who it is. <laughs> this motherfucker sucking it in, too. It's not. <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> what the fuck is that? Edward! What the fuck is that? Is, is that how I look? Holy shit. No. Martha! Martha! Here. 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 Hold it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, uh, hey, Martha's getting too excited. Uh oh. Uh oh. Booty everywhere. <laughs> Alright, he won. I'm just saying he won. <laughs> I'm, I can't compete with that. <laughs> What's up, Ed? Yeah, you can What's up? You on, uh, on Friday or what? We can have a drink. I'm yeah, I'll try to. Bring the two fifty. All right. Marsha's calling me for some reason. I just I just hung up on her. So there you go. Ed just got into. Oh, Ed just hung up on me. <laughs> All right. There you go. Pussy. Wait, who's pussy? Sushi's in the building. Does it have to be a guy? No, it doesn't have to be a guy. Mark, come on. <laughs> talk the talk, but can't walk the walk. Here it is. I'm dead as fuck. <laughs> this is this was awesome. I got my now guys ready. Good job. Good job. Oh, you got all the ladies. There it is. All the ladies got excited. That's some fucking thunder. That's some thunder from down under, you know what I'm saying? That's crazy. But that's, that's, that's the beauty of Not Your Average Radio. Who the fuck knows? We were just talking about uh, talking about your guys' problems live on Not Your Average Radio, and it became like a dance off and the Monsky dance, and I don't know what I don't know what happens. I don't know what's going on, man. But I just want to do all kinds of crazy shit. Shout out to Ed, man. He's gonna get his name in there three times. So if you guys are just uh, tuning in, uh, you guys made me dance. We got Ed dancing. It's, it, this is a party. This is Not Your Average party going on right now. Man, I gotta hang out with you guys. You guys fucking are fun as hell. You guys are probably get me in trouble though, but you guys are fun. When I mean in trouble, I don't mean by a girl. I mean like by the police. <laughs> oh man, my phone messed up. I can't right now. Vigana will dance off. I had the thong and cowboy hat. Where was the cowboy hat? Oh shit! Phil Medina's in the building. Hey Phil, let me call you in real quick, brother. Oh, here we go. Let me, let me see if Phil. Let me see if Phil answers. Oh, can't invite this guest. Oh shit, maybe maybe you're logged off. I had a shitload of you guys watching me right now. You fucking stalkers. <laughs> How do you get off? Oh, here we go. So, hey, Phil, where are you at? You at? Where are you at? Where you at? Are you coming through Hollywood tomorrow, Phil, or what? Or did he log off? He probably logged off. I was like, log on. And he's like, oh, shit. Shout out to Phil Medina, man. One of the hardest working motherfuckers I know. Man, he's he's uh, selling out shows left and right. Not only in the 805, but in Hollywood, in Madeira, all over the place, man. He's putting in work. So, thoughts on Mad Dog's statement to end Korea. What do you say? I don't know. I don't watch the news, bro. Now that I don't give you guys a little update on, on what's happening, I all I know is that Usher has herpes. He gave it to a chick, gave her um, gave her like a million bucks to shut the fuck up. Um, and then, oh wait, he supposedly gave it to her, gave her a million dollars to shut up. Then I guess he did give it to her. Supposedly she wanted like 20 some million dollars. And then some fat chick um, is suing him and she actually came out. And she said that he exposed her to herpes, but he, she didn't get it because it was like more than a year ago. But now Usher doesn't have herpes. So I don't fucking know what's going on. You see, you're talking about, I'm talking about real life situations, brother. I'm talking about Usher and herpes. This affects our lives in our society. You're talking about North Korea and fucking the United States possibly going to war. Pfft, how is that important? Come on, man. We talk about real life situations around here. I was ready to dance. Okay, we're gonna call Viviana then. Sorry, I, I I got I can't invite this guest. Why can't I invite people? What the hell? Uh says I can't invite you, Viviana. Can't invite can't invite you. Um can't invite Phil. What the fuck? 
Yes, I was ready to watch you two. You two are great. I don't know what happened. I can't invite Viviana. What the fuck? Man, they're hating on us, Viviana. They're hating on us. But when I first started doing the broadcast right here on, on YouTube, YouTube, where the fuck am I at? Well, some of you guys are watching on YouTube, and this does go to YouTube. Anyways, the guys that are on Facebook, um, it, I went live on Facebook, and it went purple. Like, purple script, like, you know, like the snowstorms, like back in the day when you had those old TVs. Um, but this was purple. It was crazy. But I can't, I can't invite you. I rejected you. I, I turned it off. I was just checking if I could, if I could call you. Oh, there we go. Now it's inviting Viviana. All right. I only have four minutes. I know it's gonna, this is about to take like four hours, but let's do it. Let's do it. There she is. Wait, hold, wait, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Back, wait, wait, do you see the ass though? What the fuck? What the fuck is that? What the fuck? Wait a minute. What the fuck is she doing? Wait, I'm trying to get my dance on. Hold up. What the fuck? Wait. <laughs> Like a hippo trying to move. Oh my oh, god. <laughs> oh fuck. The hell is that? Oh my god, this is amazing. <laughs> oh man. I think we lost her. Let me see. The fuck was that? <laughs> Victoria Robinson was happening. Mine was natural though. Yeah, you beat her. Blocker was happening, brother. Go Viv, it's your birthday. Oh shit. Let's see. Let me try to invite her again. Where the fuck's your thing? There it is. I can't invite this guest. What the hell's going on? That's so weird. And let's say her her Wi-Fi or something. Is, she's in, she lives in the middle of nowhere. We went to her house last Friday and she lives in the middle of fucking nowhere. So if her Wi-Fi is not working, then she's fucked. Legit, but anyways, man, this has been a blast. I appreciate every single one of you guys. Um, thank you for bringing out the Monsky dance in me. <laughs> I'm telling you, it has to be, has to be, uh, has to be organic. I can't just do shit. That's why people always tell me, Monsky, you need to be a comedian. You're funny, but that's the thing is that is I'm funny just because I just say shit, do shit, and whatever comes out of my mouth at that moment. I wouldn't be able to sit there just like, you see how hard it was for me to, to articulate the Monsky dance? Um, but I do it all the time. As Julie, I do it all the time. I, I'd be walking around the studio, just randomly start doing the Monsky dance just because I feel it. But um, for me, it's hard to like be scripted and have people watching me just like, all right, go. <laughs> you know what I mean? Just like, nah, I can't do it. I just, I just have to feel it. But anyways, let me try Viviana one more time. Can't invite the guest. Oh, well. I guess it was meant to be, or not meant to be. We, 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 got the, we got the meat and potatoes of it. Absolutely. Kicked for inappropriate. <laughs> wow, big old booty. Hello. Shake it. Sounds like cock blocker or something. Cool show. Block monsters in the building. You lost, you lost my... See, now the, now the little camera is off of your name, Viviana. Off of your um, thing. You say, oh... Uh, uh, oh yeah, yeah. I say uh, uh when I do the monkey dance. I go uh. Oh, maybe that's what I needed to do. It gives me the rhythm. Uh, uh, monkey dance. Uh, uh. That's what's up. That's what's going on. So Viviana, I don't know what happened. Your camera is off, off of your um, of your chinga, off your chinga. That's really weird. Let me try one more time. Nope, can't invite this guest. Anyways, I think it's time to go. Uh, nine o'clock. I'm gonna get out of here. I gotta go edit some shit real quick, and um, I gotta make some phone calls and um, take care of some business. So I appreciate you guys, man, so much for tuning in, supporting our Average Radio again. Where for you guys who are just tuning in, we're giving away fifty dollars tomorrow. Tomorrow about seven o'clock, I believe. Uh, if not, I'll let you guys know. If we're gonna go earlier. I'm pretty sure the show is at eight o'clock. I'm gonna be in Hollywood tomorrow, hanging out with the homies. Um, we're gonna give away fifty dollar give uh, fifty dollars live on our Average Radio, and also three separate Solid King shirts live right here on our Average Radio, courtesy of Solid Kings, the big homie Citric, and all the homies. Um, again, appreciate you guys for tuning in.
and uh, it's your boy Monsky. Make sure you share this video. Make sure you let your people know that we have dance offs right here. <laughs> Fucking who knows what's gonna happen? Oh yeah, and Dr. Monsky at gmail.com. Yeah, I'm gonna for you guys that didn't that weren't there, watch this video again. But real quick, um, we're gonna have a little serious time too right here on Average Radio. We, that's what it's about. It's about having fun. It's about being productive, and it's about learning. You know what I'm saying? So uh, I'm not just saying you guys. I, I want to learn from you guys as well. And I learned a lot from Ed today. So shout out to Ed. I didn't know you had the moves in you, bro. Them hips do not lie. <laughs> Anyways, I, I'm just having so much fun with you guys. Waiting for iPhone to turn on. I'm on iPad. Oh, that's why. That, but I, I, I gotta get going. We'll have we'll have um, we'll do a dance off with uh, Viviana. Oh, there's Viviana. Hold on. Now it's working. Now it's working. I, I really need to go, but I'm having too much fun. I really need to go. Inviting, inviting. There she is. Dude, the ass kicked me off the internet. <laughs> Bam, look at Kardashian. She broke, she broke the internet with that ass. What the I fuck? broke the internet with that ass. <laughs> uh, uh. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, hold she's up, still hold going. Up. I need a camera operator, though. Uh, I know. I, wait, I, whoa, I have a, um, you, you get yourself a little tripod. That's why I have my phone on. Bam! <laughs> wait, hold up. Don't you know me? You're way too into this. This is amazing. Wait, wait, hold up, hold up. Oh, fuck. I can't see nothing. Put it up higher. Oh, so wait, hold up. Let me have a dog hold the camera. <laughs> Where's the camera operator when I need one? This is too much. Wait, hold up, hold up. Hold, wait, let me fix the angle. I just want you to know this is your fault. You, All you guys, you guys wanted this. This is all you guys. Wait, can you see it? Can you see it? <laughs> You really have a Bam. big booty. I win. I win. I win, bitches. No, you, you, that shit's fake. <laughs> Ed had a real booty. Oh, see, if I had a longer shirt, you wouldn't have known. I've seen you in person. I wouldn't know. <laughs> Thank you, Party City. They have fake butts at Party City? Yeah, look. You tie it around. You, tie, <laughs> you put your legs in it. And you tie it, and bam, Kardashian, boom. Kardashian, that does that looks like that looks like what's her face? Nicki Minaj's ass, all fucking bam. fucked up like that. And you know what? I didn't have to spend all that money. It was like ten ninety nine or something like that. Boom, big butt on discount. That's what I'm talking about. That's big right. That's ghetto a booty. Hey, a ghetto booty. I just thought of a new. I thought of a new segment. Big butts on a budget. Uh that's how it's going down. Not your average radio. Not your average ass. Not your average ass. Big butts on a budget. Right. It's Big it's my welfare booty. Budget. Triple triple. I B's. can't afford it. I can't afford the injections in plastic surgery. So I gotta stuff my underwears with these. I'm playing. <laughs> Big ass crack. <laughs> <laughs> man, you guys are too much, man. This is too much All right, man. Average radio for sure. Thank you for playing. Thank you for playing. So how did your um how did your reading go last night with uh, the oh, winner last night? Oh, I didn't do the winner last night. Oh, okay. Um, I went out and meditated. I'm gonna do her on Friday because she had stuff going on. Oh, for sure. Um, you guys got to watch last night's video of me doing readings, man. I was, com I don't. They were really good, really, really, really good. Um, a couple people were like, "It's uncanny. How do you know this?" And one dude was really tripping out. He was really tripping out. Julie was, so that was good. Julie saw your Julie saw your uh your your show last night and she was like some dude was tripping out. He was and totally was like, tripping out. I was like, of but, course, you know, he kind of a shit. You know, um, sometimes uh, the messages come in stronger than others, and last night the messages were coming in just really strong. It was, I think the the moon and just all the stuff yeah. that's going on. You know, it's like everything's amplified, so crazy. That's what's but, up. Um, but it was amazing. It was a great day. And, and um, you know, it was nice to empower some people and give them the information that they needed. And, you know, it's doing what we're here to do, Absolutely. which is amazing. Absolutely. Well, thank you for uh, for playing today. I'm going to get going. So uh, I'll yeah. talk to you guys later. Have fun tomorrow. Yes. Thank you so much. See you later. Thank Be you. Be safe. All right. Bye. Love you. Bye.
Bye. All right. Anyways, I really have to go. Natural Average Radio. It's your boy Monsky. Share this video tomorrow. Picking a winner. $50. Three shirts. It's going down. That's what's up. Let's go.